Hey there, Alphonse here, and coming up next, we're going to go um, and talk about one of our uh, stories that fits into our top 10 list of um, evidence of an inside job. 9-11 was an inside job, and uh, this is why the 9-11 Truth Movement uh, thinks so. I did a search for uh, criminal insider trading in quotes, that means that I'll get pages with those words in that order, and they all also have 9-11 on the page, and I got uh, hits for 1,730 websites that mention this, criminal insider trading on 9-11. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's take a look at this chart here. On September 10th, the value of United was $30.82, and then it uh, took a real dive to 1750 on September 17th and then went back up to 1826 on, I think it was the 17th. But here's a chart that shows you the, uh, the peak there. On Thursday, United Airlines was, there were people betting the stock was going to crash. And by golly, it did by Monday. Isn't that amazing? Look, uh, yep, profiting from disaster. This is a story by ABC News now, I mean CBS News. And uh, it's a pretty good story, and they tell you some truth, but they fail to mention that there were no anomalous uh, trades on Delta or any other airline. And uh, they don't mention that there were anomalous trades on firms that happen to be located in the World Trade Center complex. And they go on. Uh, the company says it has looked at the orders and has determined no evidence of any suspicious activity. But then they say one, at least one Wall Street firm reported the uh, anomalies and the suspicions to the SEC. Now, in my opinion, this is kind of like if you had um, the head of the lottery board in your state and his uh, uncle won the lottery one week and then the next month his mother won the lottery and then the next month his daughter won the lottery, uh, I think the FBI would be all over that like white on rice. Yeah, they wouldn't let it stand. And I got a lot of this information from uh, 911 Research. WTC. Uh, so there's a whole bunch of information about it. I mean, if you don't know about this, uh, I don't know what rock you've been hiding under. Probably the mainstream media rock, who will rock your mind with a bunch of baloney and uh, half truths and misinformation. Uh, but all kinds of price probabilities and predictions. Uh, Exchange examines odd jump from Associated Press. There's, you know, just a plethora of information about this. And we're going to do a series of top ten pieces of evidence of inside job. As a matter of fact, I think we're going to have 11, a list of 11 of the top ten, uh, just to uh, point to a little bit of irony. Uh, but I hope that you enjoyed that. And uh, do like I did. Just uh, search and read all those 1,700 and some odd websites. And then you'll be uh, aware of uh, maybe who these people are and what they're up to. And maybe once we know what we're up against, we can do something about it. I mean, these are just things. But uh, uh, this is Alphonse uh, signing off for now. I don't want to take up a lot of your time. And that's what we'll do here with these uh, uh, 11 of the top 10 um, evidences of inside job on 9-11 uh, is make them short and sweet, hard-hitting, to the point. And uh, the goal will be to create curiosity. And uh, hopefully the listener or the watcher uh, will uh, take the initiative to type a few words into Google and start reading. Alphonse signing off for now. 
Check our website out. It's v911t.org. Thanks for listening.